In this video, we're going to review the short crust Raspberry Pi case. This case is a nice, simple, minimal case with a glossy, transparent black top and a plastic shell. Here's the front of the case. You can just see the SD card underneath there. And on the back, they have made it so you can plug in the power there alongside the Ethernet and USB ports. The HDMI is in the same place and no other ports have been moved. So here you can see the bottom of the case. We have the SD card slot and a little release trigger where the Raspberry Pi is held into the case and also the rubber feet. So here you can see the SD card a bit closer and it's just simple slot in and out. Here you can see the cover for the analog ports and the top of the case. This is the shell for the main case. It has the little extension cable for the plug, which lets you plug the cable into the other end. And you also have the top, which is a smooth glossy finish with the short crust logo on it. You have the analog video and headphone jack cover if you want to put that in place. And it also comes with two screws to attach the top of the case onto the main shell. And you also have a little allen key to screw those screws in. So to put it together, you just want to plug the power cable into the Raspberry Pi and just clip the Raspberry Pi into place. Then what you want to do is add the analog cover if you want to, and then attach onto the top the glossy black cover. That is then attached into place by two screws which I will just put in first by tightening them by hand and then I'll use the Allen key just to secure them into place. Now that that's done, you can put in your SD card and attach the rubber feet. But otherwise you're done and you can wipe off the top to make sure it's all nice and clean and start using your case. That has been a quick look and review of the short crust Raspberry Pi case. If you liked it, make sure to subscribe. Links to get the case will be in the description and thank you for watching.